Well, hello, ladies and gentlemen. For all those who've joined us a little early, we're about four minutes from the start here at the uh, swimming event at the Youth A World Championships. This is the men's final. Earlier this morning, Luis Cruz of Mexico won the fencing. We will have here the 200 meter freestyle. Six heats to go. We will start with heat one. The uh, swimmers are paired in their respective heats according to their personal best times in the last 12 months. And as you can see there on your screen, we will have the first heat where we'll see Andres Garza of Mexico come out first. He will be in lane six. He will be followed by Korea's Injun Gong in lane five. Mexico's Luis Cruz, the current leader, will be in lane four. Czech Republic's Martin Flach will be in lane three. Belarus's Mikita Harnasteu will be in lane two. And then in lane one, we'll have Italy's Gianluca Micozzi. Now, this is very interesting here because the two leaders, well, Cruz, who won the fence who first, followed closely by Gianluca Micozzi, will be in the slowest heat here at the pool. And here you have our swimmers coming out. As I said, Gaza of Mexico will be in lane six, Gong of Korea in lane five, Cruz of Mexico in lane four, Flach of Czech Republic in lane three, Harnasteu of Belarus in lane two, and Mikotsi in lane one. This is the men's final at the USA World Championships in Budapest. 36 athletes are competing. There are a total of three events here today. We've had the fencing this morning, where Cruz in lane four was victorious. We will have the swim here, and then afterwards we will be live from half past 3 p.m. local time for the combined, where we will see who will be crowned the Youth A World Champion for 2014. And here we have the presentation. Flach of Czech Republic. Our leader here, Luis Cruz of Mexico in lane four. Gong of Korea here in lane five. And Gaza of Mexico in lane six. Two Mexicans in this heat. The ones to look out for are Flach and Cruz, who have clocked personal best times in the last 12 months of just over 2 minutes 10 here for the 200 meter freestyle. Lane 1 is the closest to you as we reach the first 25 meters. And we can see Flach just about ahead. Followed closely by Cruz. And here is Cruz in lane four. It's neck and neck here. Looks like Flach is just about ahead again, followed closely in second by Harnasteu of Belarus.
Schaffler here in lane three leading. Followed by Harnastil and it looks like Cruz is in third position. Now we're just in the last 50 meters here. It's neck and neck. It looks like Harnastil is accelerating. Just 25 meters to go here. And Harna Steel from Belarus here in lane two. Looks like he will clock the fastest time here in heat one. Flach of Czech Republic will be second. And then Gong of China in third with Kuz in fourth. Powerful swimming here by the Belarusian in the last 50 meters. As we go through the heats, the times will get faster. And I can confirm that Harna Steel of Belarus here in your picture was the winner here in heat one. Still five heats to go here in the uh, swim. This is the uh, men's final at the 2014 Youth World Championships coming live from Budapest. Now we wait for heat two where we'll see coming out first Emiliano Hernandez of Mexico in lane six, Chu Juan Li of China in lane four, Ivan Kamitsu of Belarus in lane four, Youssef Abdelaziz of Egypt in lane three, Serge Baranov of Russia in lane two, and finally Italy's Daniele Colasanti in lane one. This will be heat two of the 200 meter freestyle swim. As we wait for the athletes to get ready. And there we have it. First, Hernandez of Mexico, followed by Lee of China, followed by Kamitsu of Belarus, followed by Abdelaziz of Egypt, with Baranov and Kolasanti bringing up the rear here. Just about to get ready in heat two here for the 200 meter freestyle. This is Colasanti of Italy in lane one, Baranov of Russia in lane two, Abdelaziz of Egypt in lane three. Kamitsu of Belarus in lane four. Lee of China in lane five. And finally, in lane six, Hernandez of Mexico. The fastest time this year in this heat was clocked by Youssef Abdelaziz of Egypt in lane three, two minutes, 6.06. Very fast start there by Abdelaziz in lane three. As we reach the 50 meter mark, it looks like Kolasanti is in second place, followed by Baranov of Russia in third. Abdelaziz of Egypt in lane three, still ahead.
This is the halfway point, 100 meters still to go in the 200 meter freestyle swim. Abdel Aziz in first, followed by Baranov of Russia and Colasanti of Italy in third position. He's looking very strong here. Looks like Baranov of Russia is consolidating this second position in lane two. Just 50 meters to go. So Abdelaziz is still ahead, followed by Baranov in second and Kolasanti in third position. The last 25 meters here. There's an attack by Baranov. It looks like Abdelaziz will win here. And there you have it. Youssef Abdelaziz of Egypt has won here in Heat 2. Still four heats to go here in the men's final at the UFA World Championships in Budapest. We will begin uh, shortly with the third heat of the 200 meter freestyle here. As we see Australia's Max Esposito there, ready to come out. He will be in lane six. In lane five, we'll have China's Zhu Cheng Xu. In lane four, we'll have Korea's Chang Wan Seo. In lane three, another Korean, Si Jung Kim. Belarus's Yaroslav Ratsyuk will be in lane two with Richard Bredsky of Hungary in lane one. There'll be almost nothing to choose here between the athletes. Their personal bests this year are all at two minutes five for this 200 meter freestyle. So Esposito of Australia will be in lane six. China's Xu in lane five. Korean pair Seo and Kim will be in lane four and three respectively with Ratsyuk of Belarus in two and Hungary's Richard Beretsky here in lane one. This is the third heat of six here at the USA World Championships. This is the men's final brought to you from the Hungarian capital Budapest as we see Beretsky here of Hungary in lane one. In lane two we have Ra Ra Ratsyuk of Belarus. This is Kim from Korea. His compatriot Seo. This is Xu of China. He's in lane five. And here is Max Esposito of Australia in lane six. Looks like Shu Huan Li of China is leading here as we reach the 50 meter mark. And 
it's neck and neck behind him. Very impressive swimming here by the Chinese. Incredible speed here by uh, Xu in lane five. Can he keep up the pace? like he will beat his personal best this year which was two minutes 5.63 now who is in second position it looks like Kim of Korea as we see the final few meters for Shoot of China, who will win this at a canter? And it looks like Max Esposito will come in second, followed by lane two, Radziuk of Belarus. Well, that was an extremely fast swim here by Xu of China in the third heat of six in the men's final. This is the 200 meter freestyle, still the combined to go this afternoon to see who will be crowned the Youth A world champion. Yeah, we wait for the athletes of lane four to come out. which will contain Gergely Rigos of Hungary, Ricardo Vera of Mexico, Ahmed Shahin of Egypt, Brendan Anderson of USA, Soma Tomashov of Hungary, and Alexander Lifanov of Russia. So we reached the halfway point here in the swimming event of the men's final. And in this heat four, the personal best times are at two minutes, four seconds for this 200 meter freestyle. Here you have China's Su sharing a few jokes with his teammates. That was very impressive in the third heat by the Chinese. And there we have Rigos of Hungary, followed by Vera, followed by Shahin of Egypt, followed by USA's Anderson, followed by Tomashov of Hungary, and finally, Lifanov there of Russia in the white cap. Lifanov came six overall in defense earlier this morning with 21 victories and only 14 defeats on the pistes. And here is Alexander Lifanov of Russia. His personal best this year was 2 minutes 4.81. As you see in lane 2, Soma Tomashov of Hungary. A very strong presence by the home nation here. This is US national champion Brendan Anderson. In lane 3, Egypt's Shahin Ahmed here in lane 4. Here's Ricardo Vera of Mexico, the world record holder for the fastest shoot in a pentathlon event. And finally, we have Gergely Rigos of Hungary in lane six here. This is the fourth heat of the 200 meter freestyle swim here in the men's final of the 2014 Youth World Championships.
As we reach the 50 meter mark, it looks like Lifanov in lane one is just edging ahead. But there's almost nothing to choose here between these six athletes. But yes, at the bottom of your screen, it looks like Lifanov of Russia has found a good rhythm. Lifanov at the top of your screen in lane one, still ahead here. But there seems to be some surging and jostling. And it looks like we have a new provisional leader in lane five, Ricardo Vera of Mexico. Yeah, it looks like Lifanov is now in second position. As Brendan Anderson now of USA emerges ahead in the last straight. And yes, it looks like Anderson came first. And I would say Rigos Gergeli of Hungary came in second. Very good swimming here by the American. Looks a very good prospect after having won the Nationals just a few weeks ago. And that was the fourth heat of six here in the 200 meter freestyle swim. Here we see the swimmers of Heat 5 getting ready to come out as we have Marek Kirch of Czech Republic here on the right-hand side of your screen with just behind him Gustav Gustenau of Austria. They're just about ready to come out. In lane 6 we'll have Marek Kirch of Czech Republic. In lane 5... Austria's Gustav Gustenau in lane four, Vladislav Ritvansky of Ukraine with Ben Skardos of Hungary in lane three, Danila Glavacic of Russia in lane two, and then finally Italy's Matteo Ciccinelli in lane one. High fives, last few words of encouragement from the coaches. is the penultimate heat here in the 200 meter freestyle and here is Ciccinelli of Italy he will be in lane one and here we have Matteo Ciccinelli of Italy Danila Glavacic of Russia in lane two. Ben Skardos of Hungary in lane three. He has the fastest time here of this heat in the last 12 months. As we see Vladislav Ridvansky of Ukraine here in lane four. And here's Gustav Gustenau of Austria. He will be in lane five. And in the sixth lane, we have Marek Kirks of Czech Republic. Thank you, Mark. 
very fast start here. Looks like Matteo Ciccinelli in lane one here on the left hand side of your screen is just ahead. Yeah, the Italian looking strong here as we reach the 100 meter mark. Followed closely by Benz Cardos in lane three with the yellow cap. And here is Cardos. Cicinelli just about holding onto his lead. Cardos is in second within lane five. Gusten now of Austria. And this is the last 50 meters. Can Ciccinelli hold on to his lead here? Final 25. And it looks like it will be Ciccinelli, Cardos and Gustenau in the top three positions. Very good swimming here by the Italian Ciccinelli. He seems happy with his time. He will need these valuable points as he came 23rd overall in the fence. It's been a very good uh, weekend so far for the Italians. As we saw Aurora Tonietti win the gold in the women's final. The boys also took bronze in the team relay as the women of Italy took the gold in the women's relay. So we wait for the final heat here in the 200 meter freestyle of the men's final at the 2014 Youth A World Championships. We are streaming live from the Hungarian capital Budapest as we see here with the red cap Anton Kuznetsov of Ukraine he will be followed by Dovidas Vaivada of Lithuania very impressive in the qualifiers and then in this final heat we will have Alexander Stepashev of Russia Great Britain's Henry Chung who almost bro broke the world record just a few days ago in the qualifiers. In lane two, we'll have Tovkai Alexander of Ukraine and in lane one, Su Hyuk Yun of Korea. So keep an eye out for lane three, Henry Chung, an extremely fast swimmer here. This is the final heat. As we look at Korea's Yun Suhyuk here, he will be in lane one. There's tough guy Alexander here of Ukraine in lane two. Now keep an eye out for this guy, Henry Chung of Great Britain. This is Alexander Stepashev of Russia in lane four. The extremely talented Dovidas Vaivada of Lithuania in lane five. And finally, in lane six, Anton Kuznetsov of Ukraine. This will be extremely fast, ladies and gentlemen. Keep an eye out for lane three. Henry Chung here.
looks like the Brit is just ahead after 50 meters. And it looks like Stepashev of your Russia in lane four is in second position. And this is the halfway mark. Chung in first, Stepashev in second. And their last 50 meters, Chung now in a, with a commanding lead. Stepashev is currently in second position. And in third, it looks like it's Dovidas Vaivada. And this will be another impressive performance by Chung. with Stepashev in second. Ooh, and very close there for third. I think Yun of Korea might have got it. And here is the winner of the swim, Henry Chung of Great Britain. And this was the final heat of six here in the men's final 200 meter freestyle swim. They will be now leaving the arena to get ready for the combined event, which will be the last discipline of the day. We will return for the live stream in about two and a half hours. And here we have the results of the first heat. So ladies and gentlemen, I hope you've enjoyed this. Don't forget to subscribe to the UIPM YouTube channel so that you don't miss any of the action when we return later today. We will also bring you live stream from the mix relay tomorrow. And there, what an impressive time there, Baksu of China. Sub two minutes. And there's the confirmation that Ciccinelli of Italy was victorious in the fifth heat. And I hope that we will have confirmation of the times for Chung, not yet in from the judges. Hopefully that will arrive soon. We will leave the stream there live for you until we get the confirmation of the times. But please stay tuned and come back and see us later when we will bring you the combined event here at the 2014 Youth A World Championships.